This is the TST video on how to remove the valve stem gasket. The valve stem gasket is internal on the bottom of the sensor. This is where the valve stem actually screws into the sensor. It's a little rubber gasket. And the only time you're going to replace that is if you have a leak in that area. Um, also, the gasket on the cap and the flow through are both the same type of gasket and it's the same procedure. So what we're going to do is we're going to take a pick tool. You need something like a, a dental pick or you need a heavy duty needle and you can put that in here and you can grab, grab that rubber gasket and pull it out. You got to be just careful of the center pin. There it is. I pulled it out and I'm going to replace it with a new gasket. I've got my new gasket here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to place that gasket on the top and try to get it down a little bit. And then I'm going to take a small screwdriver and I'm going to tamp it down basically all the way around and get it down as far as I can get it. Now you don't have to get it all the way to the base because once you get it down far enough, and you screw it onto the valve stem, it will automatically seat itself. So get it down as far as you can, and then put it on the valve stem and seat it and check to make sure you don't have any leaks. And that's how you change the valve stem gasket on a TST cap or flow through sensor.